All right, Taylor, thanks. State health officials are encouraging families to make sure their students are vaccinated before they return to school in August. Wait, Day Wednesday, Dave Brazelton joins us live now with details on the importance of getting the proper vaccinations. Dave. Nikkel, according to Dr. Wes Stubblefield of the Alabama Department of Public Health, vaccine preventable diseases like chicken pox, meningitis, measles, and whooping cough are still seen in our public schools. Keeping up to date with vaccines is the best way to prevent other students from getting it. As July draws to a close, families are preparing for the beginning of the school year. Whether it's pre-kindergarten, seventh grade, college, or any year in between, families are shopping for clothes, backpacks, and school supplies. But now is the time to make sure students' immunizations are up to date and the health records needed for the school entry are in order. Our advice is, is to get in with your health care provider as quickly as possible and not wait until we get closer to August where we have limited appointment slots and, we, and we're all full and everyone is scrambling to get their vaccines done before school. The first thing I would do is call your local health department. We have, we have health departments in all 67 counties, um, in, in, but they're not all staffed at every day, at every time for every service. So my, my advice would be is that you go to your, or you call your county health department, you explain the situation that you, your child may need vaccines and they don't have a primary care provider. Um, and then they will instruct you on when and where that can happen and uh, how, how that can get done. As you review the list for your family, you should contact your school's doctor's office to check the records for each child to determine if they have received the proper immunizations. Students who are entering Alabama for the first time must transfer their out-of-state vaccine records before they can begin school. If they come from another state, um, then they now that we've switched to an electronic system, all of the all the immunizations are put into this uh, this immunization database, and those immunizations can be, if they're brought from another state, can be imported into the database, and then they are given what's called a certificate of immunization, which um, the school nurses also have access to. If you're unsure of your child's vaccine records, the time to act is now. Contact your county health department. And we all know that we're preparing for the new school year is a busy time, but by scheduling your child's school shots, you will, you will avoid any unnecessary delays. Reporting live from Athens, Dave Brazelton, Way 31 News.